Okay, hello uh, everyone. Uh, welcome to another episode of Cardboard for Mars. Today, uh, we have a very special guest. Uh, for those of you who have watched our uh, videos before, you'll know him as Q, uh, fan of the Star Trek show. Uh, no, I'm just kidding. That was just me. But uh, <laughs> here he is in the flesh for the first time. Q, Q, do you want to introduce yourself? Yeah, so it all started with me playing against you while we were streaming and then we started discussing a lot of games in the stream and you described me as the slightly antagonic player, I think, something like this, so uh -huh. because Q of Star Trek and at some point we decided that uh, playing games together is fun as well and here I am, let's go. <laughs> and I think when we are playing together, no one has any chance against us. <laughs> I love it. Yeah, for those of you for those of you who don't know, Q Q is a very strong player. Uh, he was in the top of the leaderboards on the uh, TM website for a while. Uh, routinely crushes me. Uh, so um, it will be it will be fun to have him on my team for once. Uh, and it's a great opportunity to ask questions and stuff Hopefully like that. Not for once. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was. Um... I think I've reached place two at some point, but then I've I've lost it again. And I've, I think to be competitive in the top 10, you need to have really good nerves because sometimes when you have two game crashes in a row and it, those were games you were winning and you are losing ELO points for that, then you are like, bah! Yeah, yeah, it's, it's frustrating. And that's, yeah, that's when I decided, okay, I don't really care that much about the rank anymore. So how did you how did you uh, how did you find out about terraforming Mars? Um, some friends showed me. Um, I'm meeting uh, once in a year, mostly in the summer, with some friends who are really playing a lot of board games, and they introduced me to all new board games. They think they are worth it. And terraforming Mars was, of course, I think last year. I've played one game. I've got. Hmm, I've ended up last in this game, but it was my first game, and I've made. For example, I've played uh, Corporate Stronghold without any greeneries, yeah. just for the minus two VP. Wow. <laughs> and I was like, okay, those cities, they suck because they give negative VP. They cost energy. They are expensive. Why do I even build those? And after, but I, at the end of the game, I realized how all the things are working out, but it was too late. Yeah. But I still loved the idea of the game. And because it's a bit difficult to find players in my region, I've decided to play it online. Where do, where do you live? Um, I live in southern Germany, and it's more of a rural area. Also, rural. Yeah. Uh, it's it's clear, okay. And uh, I'm working as a teacher, so I've already taught some students terraforming Mars. They are and they enjoy to play it, but they play it to uh, they they like the game because they like to play asteroids and bombing each other plants and playing virus and sabotage and not really for the um <laughs> developing of a game right, economy right, or right. something they're they're no match for you q <laughs> not really but it's also another another way of having fun in the game yeah yeah for sure no i mean i i love those moments uh <laughs> but in um, this round don't play equal line it's it's pointless because you will never have any plans <laughs> yeah yeah i don't i what do you what do you think about eco line because i hate eco line um eco line is for me a corp i've which i choose if the other option is worse so i think i have my first game i've streamed was eco line already because the other corp didn't fit in at all and I had i had a bacteria for two more plant production i think so it was like hmm don't really know what to do. Let's go Ecoline and hope to get both uh, uh, Mayer and Gardner. It's, yeah. I don't like to play Ecoline on stream because you are dependent on the others not playing Asteroids. And I always don't like a setup where you are dependent on either Luck or the other players to help you. So Ecoline is not my favorite one. What do you, well, think, do you about, think about uh, it? What do you think? So, if you have eco line and protected Habs in your opener, do you think it's good? <laughs> Usually, yes. But at the moment, we have a bug that you can still bomb the plants of someone having protected habitats. So, at the moment, no. Otherwise, yeah. <laughs> oh, is that right? I didn't realize that's a bug right now. 
Yeah, uh, right now there's a bug that you can always bomb the first player, no matter if he has the production. So you can even play... Uh, uh, how's the thing called that take uh, asteroid consortium is oh, the one that, that steals that. titanium yeah you can play that and you can steal uh, you can take this uh, titanium production from someone who doesn't even have titanium production because he's the first player oh i did not know so that that's, that's frustrating and yeah that's why um, predicted tabs don't really make sense at the moment otherwise yeah it's a good combo all right here oh well there we go. <laughs> and we've got eco line <laughs> 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 well, that's great Saturn Systems is you can always pick it even if you don't have Jovians doesn't matter yeah well and we've got we've hey. got two two good Jovians two okay okay this is a Saturn Systems game alright so what do you think uh, Terraforming Ganymede for sure yeah and Callisto and Callisto for sure what else do you like you well Alloys is tempting but do we have anything to boost, uh, we have microbes, something. Yeah, we do have microbes. I mean, um, we could go industrial microbes and um, Redcam and MATLAB. Well, we can. We basically can take anything here. <laughs> yeah, I mean, all these cards are good. Um, okay, let's check. If we keep, uh, we basically can keep nine cards if you want to. Wow. I definitely like I like microbes, and I like medical lab. I like Radchem Factory. What do you think about this package? Yeah, but on the other side we have viral enhancers and the um, go to the left. Yeah, I'm on the, the ecologists. This is also a great combo, and we have advanced alloys. We have titanium production. We have steel production, which means it will pay off in six generations. It's all, and if we pick up another. Um, steel production, it, it's even better. I would pick up alloys for sure. Okay, alloys, and you want to go ecological zone and uh, viral enhancers? I'm not sure about that. We might not have time for it, so it's a tough pick up. Maybe not, maybe not. Okay. Be so you want to Because go it will be something we will always delay because we will play it later, and at some point we realize it's not worth anymore. Yeah. It might be an interest. Uh, Corporate stronghold, but we also use uh, we already use our energy for um, yeah for this guy. So we have twenty four cash. We can play um, we can play Callisto mines. Perfect. Yeah. So because we're so taking we're picking one two three four five six, six so it's twenty four minus four. Yeah, we we should have enough then. Yeah. Because I like to spend my energy in the same turn, I get it. So we can play industrial microbes and red come in one turn. It's better. Yeah, so that nobody hacks your energy in the meantime. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna go with these Q. What do you think? Yep, I agree. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna let you take the driver's seat in this one. I'm gonna be the color commentary. Oh, uh, uh, that's okay. No, it's you know because I because nobody everybody's seen me play this a lot, but they haven't seen <laughs> you. So uh, hey. Did you just say that my streams are not watched by people? I have well, so I've been so busy. I've been out of town the last like three weeks, and so yeah. I posted a few that uh, I'd recorded before, but I just haven't had much time to play. Yeah. Um, you should stream on. Uh, you should just use our. You should just. I'll just give you the stuff for CFM. You just stream it on our channel. Yeah. To be honest, I'm not sure um, how the um, the copyright things are. Uh, because Germany is really strict at that. Is there any problem to stream a game and upload a video later? So uh, I don't could think so. I mean could Frixilius Games claim something from streamers? No. Hmm? Um, he played our asteroid mining. Oh, nice guy. Yeah. Um, he, I mean, he's boosting our um, cash production. Yeah, no, that's true. Uh, that's a good card though to play first. Um, okay, so uh, I think we're gonna go ahead and play Callisto Penal Mines. Yep, and that's it for this turn. That's all we got. The only thing I don't like about him, asteroid mining, is that he might also go for Trovians, but and I think if we choose certain systems, they will hack Trovians anyway, if they are somehow decent players, so it doesn't matter. Yeah, I agree. Um, and, and like obviously, if you, get, if you get all the multipliers, it can be really good. That's kind of what happened for us in the last game. But if you don't, yeah. you can still just go space strategy and, and not rely on the Jovians. Um, I think the 
uh, the best thing about set and systems is that you start with for cash production. You start with a Jovian tech, you start with a titanium production, which means your economy is already boosted by four. That's why I pick set and systems, even if I don't have Jovians. Yeah. Just because it's a, a great start compared to if it compared to Tractor, you start with eighteen cash less and with four cash productions more. It's a deal I would take any time. Yeah. Well, I mean, it's interesting because, like, think about Helion, right? Like, so uh, Saturn system starts with, um, what, 45 cash, is it? 45? Um, Helion starts with 45 and 3 heat, which is basically cash production, right? So, yeah. but I, I don't think Helion's very good. So, I mean, obviously, it's better if you have a Jovian. Yeah, I don't, I don't like Helion as well, mostly because if I don't see the... Um thermodynamic thing, I don't know how it's called, that steals to heat production, there's always a card in play that basically ruins your corp at start. Yeah, yeah. I kind of feel that way about Asteroid Mining Consortium with Saturn Systems, but it's so much harder to get that going because you have to have titanium production. Okay. I'm not sure if I should watch the stream or watch Skype. Uh, yeah, I think Skype is more live. Yeah. Okay. I probably would go deep well yeah, heating. I think so too. Because it's another building tag, right? Yeah, I have a, a small eye on builder, and they don't have building companies, so we might be able to um, compete builder. Is there any other milestone we can go? I... Well, um, with what we have, there's not not a lot that's presenting itself. Um... Nope. I think builder it is. Yeah, so that means that this turn we should probably go microbes, radcam. Um, yeah, if we don't buy free cards, then we can do it. So ideally, ideally we buy two cards, so we have exactly twenty cash to get uh, microbes and radcam. Mm -hmm. Right, if we have two cards, yep. And then basically, we should free just save our uh, save our uh, minerals until. Uh, until we have advanced alloys on. Um, higher traders, always. You like this over fish? Yeah, definitely. Right now, I see no one who will bump the heat because Helion will most likely spend his uh, heat for... Um, Ooh, I like insulation. Lake yeah, game. just... Yeah, I, will, I, I won't keep it. I will, I, will, I will take it. So Helion can't go for both... Um, Thermalist and banker. Thermalist and get yeah, exactly. Yeah, and it's also good that we just saw insulation, so we know we can maybe fund banker later, and don't get um, surprised. So you want to take deep well heating, and uh, would you actually take higher raiders? Of course, because we have advanced alloys, which means we pay four for the card. Yeah, and uh, get six if someone picks up steel. Okay, and we are able to um, stop someone. Okay, I like it. I tend to not uh, play those hate cards all that much, but... Uh, oh, let right. the hate flow you. <laughs> so let's go uh, Industrial Microbes and Radcam. And Radcam, and then you pass. Um, Helion has 50 cash right now, I think. He probably will hammer out IO Mining. Is there any other card that makes sense for him? Uh, let me think here. I mean, maybe immigration shuttles, immigration shuttles, but most likely we'll see an IO mining now. Or he's not an experienced player. Yeah, it would make sense. Uh, no, Teractor has. Uh, yeah, no, you're. Yeah, nobody has fifty. He's got forty-four. Uh, he cards. Yeah, you're, I see what you're saying. I don't know. IO with Helion doesn't seem to make that much sense. Maybe Soletta or something like that. Oh. He had a uh, so letter, he had 50, he bought two cards. Yeah, yeah he would have run short for the letter last turn as well. I'm not a big fan of Helion Saletta, to be honest. Why is that? Because um, you don't want to spend your heat as money as Helion because uh, heat production is way more expensive than um, cash production. If you compare, for example, um, you pay six for sponsors, but you pay nine for the card that gives you two heat production. 
So basically, heat production is more expensive cash production for Helion. Yeah, although like sometimes I see heat players play Helion and they just focus so much on the heat tracker. And um, ah, okay, immigration shuttles. I yeah. called that out. <laughs> 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 well done, well done. But but you get my point about um, Helion and um, using heat as cash. It's just not that effective. Yeah, no, I, I, I do get that. Um, maybe that's part of why that corporation seems a little bit underwhelming. But like a lot of times when I see people play Helion, they tend to either use it all as cash or they, they put it all as heat, you know? And um, the all as heat strategy doesn't seem to work that well. I, I don't... But the all cash either. Yeah. It's probably just a hybrid, you know, like kind of use it as, I don't know. I think uh, as the, the way I use Helion, or I love to use Helion the most, is just ignore the heave past and um, considering Helion as an, a corporation that starts with true cash, produ cash yeah. production. Yeah. But even then, it's not as good as credit card taxes, set on systems, or uh, uh, maybe even director. Yeah. It's just a corporation. You can pick if the other one is. Um, uh, UNMI and you don't have anything to boost your terraforming points. Yeah, yeah. How do you feel about UNMI? <laughs> I, I always end up uh, uh, with 50 or more terraforming points and losing the game with yeah. UNMI. Yeah, that's how I feel about it too. That's exactly what happens with UNMI. The, totally the game I lost to you was a UNMI game too. So. Oh, was it? <laughs> yeah. Bad corporation can't be me, can't be you, can only be the corporation. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Um, all right. Um, the reason why I like to past invention contest, which Helion just played, is that it's. I think it's burying money because he just paid five cash just to pick up one card. It's mostly one card is not five cash worth. So, all these pick up cards uh, for more money at start, I think it's it's not worth the price. You better get up your economy going. Yeah. Yeah, I kind of agree with that. Although the the time that I actually like the filter cards is uh, is specifically when you're playing Saturn systems because you you just want to be able to get those multipliers. They're worth so much. Um, yeah, but I don't but like I don't like playing them early. I agree with you because your money production is so important early. First, that and on, uh, also you get dependent on luck again if you pick up those cards, and I don't like being dependent on um, such uh, luck mechanics. Yeah, no, that's true. Uh, but I think they're pretty good in like like two thirds of the way through the game when you're kind of when your economy is all set up and things are going and you're just yeah. digging for cards. Yeah, yeah. Uh, especially if you have um, Earth Catapult or your Antigrav. So <laughs> yeah, yeah, <laughs> you love Antigrav, right? <laughs> yeah, I I love Earth Catapult. Yeah, because it's better. It doesn't have global requirements, does the same, and it's just a little bit more expensive. And it has an Earth tech, so if you have Earth Office. <laughs> All right, let's see what we got on this one. Yeah, our turns were short so far. Okay. Uh, maybe just peroxide power. We don't really have a reason to have power right now, but. I mean that would give us yeah. three. We might, you know, we'd be pretty close to one of the, uh, you yeah. know, the steelworks things. It's a building. Yeah, we, we saw a steelwork things. Uh, we could, we could, could also pick up standard tech, but do we will use do we will use a lot of standard techs? I don't see us at the moment. I will pick up peroxide just for the uh, building tech and also to deny energy cards for them. Maybe they are waiting for energy. Okay, I like that. I, I think peroxide power is what I would have taken there too. Uh, I do okay. like. I mean, standard tech can be good sometimes, but um, yeah. I don't know. It's also always worth a hack, I think. Oh wow! Um, Anti grav. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> you should have picked up standard tech for picking anti grav now. No, I. I know. But right now, what do you like uh, between sabotage and comet? Uh, can we, can you show the hand again? Yes. I mean, we don't have that much big plans for our um, titanium. So 
What I don't like is that we uh, leave Sabotage in the game because we are leading at the moment, they will hate us. I think, but I so think... we're, we're, passing, we're passing up this round, so we're passing to Teractor as well. Yeah, but um, I, I will still pick up the Comet. Yeah, I think it's better. And, and hope they don't hate us. Who could hate us? <laughs> um, okay, I think both are our garbage you can just take something all right i'll just take the tundra farming yeah i agree because um energy saving is um so costly uh trojan horse it always seems to be good but it never is it is actually so give them the chance to make a mistake and pick it up all right so uh we'll take towing a comet it gives us something to do with titanium yeah. do you and, um, do you want peroxide power you yeah, I would pick it up too. Okay. All right. It's a, a card we might use later, and it's a building tech we might need to secure a builder. So we could play uh, our comet this turn. Yep. Which will give us two terraforming points and uh, two plants we don't need. Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, we. we uh, no, we. Ah! Uh, we we need to play alloys before. I agree. So maybe we focus. Maybe we focus on these things. I guess. I guess there's no re to, reason to play peroxide power, but a, a deep well heating might be something we could play. Deep well heating. Um, ah, the bribed. The bribed. The most overrated card in the game. Yeah, it's not. It's only good if you're going for. Uh, um, terraformer. Uh, can you show our hand again? Yeah. Uh, I mean, I don't really see the point in deep well heating. We paste 13 and we get one cash production. The energy we don't need. It's true. Yeah. I mean, the only thing is that it kind of it gets us a little closer to playing medical lab. We have two tags, so. I mean, if you think of this as like a mid-game card, but I, it's obviously nice if you can get a, a bump out of like, you know, four. I mean, it. if you want to rush things, we can get down alloys, then we can get down hired raiders to steal free cash, and then we have exactly the sum we need for topping a comet. This could be a thing. I'm, I'm fine with that play. And uh, Who would we steal the cash from? I guess it has to be Teractor. Yeah, is Teractor... Uh, he's playing all the oceans he wanted to play. Oh, this sucks. Well, we actually it sets up our hired raiders though. We can take two steel from him now. Oh, that's that's great. So, how about playing advanced alloys and hired raiders and steal this? Oh, he he still might sabotage us <laughs> as a back. Well, I think we should go ahead and take his steel now, don't you think? Okay. I mean, I guess yeah. he'll yeah. give us three cash, but I mean, we could wait if you want. Yeah, uh, I, I think taking the steel is okay. All right. Yeah. He took our. Um, uh, we can just skip here. Yeah. Because we will, we need to play alloys anyway. But if you play alloys now, then we just uh, encouraged him to take our steel. So, hmm. We have, we have two building techs at the moment. I think we've got three, or no, we may have two. Yeah, two, and then so, uh, okay. three, four, five. So I think we. I would play, like to play medical cap for free cash production at least. Yeah, I agree. I, uh, we could play. We could play alloys. Uh, alloys and um, deep well heating. Yeah, yeah, I think it's okay. That's what I was thinking. I mean, the uh, we could also just drop a comet. I mean, it does give us two cash back, so it's not. Yeah, but we did, then we didn't play alloys. That's true. No, we got to get alloys down. I agree. If, if we're going to play also, this card. Yeah. After the ice asteroid, 
we are not in uh, such a big rush to play the Comet. If you get a better space card, oh, how much heat production this guy has? He has eight heat production. Yeah. He's behind us, so if we bump the heat this turn, we should be in position to take it, but we are setting up Teractor for that little bump. That's that's okay. That's that's totally fine. Because uh, I'm not even sure if it's worth buying the heat step just for the heat bump, yeah. the 14 cash. But if Teractor decides to do this move, then hey, so let's invite him to make a, mis a slightly misplay and go for deeper heating. Okay, so we're going to go alloys, heat. Alloys, well, yep. Looks like Teractor and might be going for planner. How much cards do you see? He's got see? nine. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, I actually think it would be good news because it would block him. Uh, it would keep him busy for a while. We shouldn't forget Terraformer because we are getting two more terraforming points out of the Comet if you play it. Yep. And we can get three terraforming points out of Ganymede. I, I'm not a friend of playing Ganymede early, but if it gives us terraform, it might be worth a thing. I mean, if you pick another Trovian, then Ter um, Ganymede is already a six-point card. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Um, I like the idea of pushing towards Builder first to secure that. Um, yeah, but we are, not, we are not in a rush, I think. Yeah. I think we have luck with the cooperation Citros because a mining guild or a uh, cinematics would be problematic for us. Why do you say that? Yeah, because you want to get builder, but getting builder again mine, against mining guild or uh, IC is just phew, yeah. a tough spot. Yeah. Close to impossible, I think. Even Tass is starting with a building tech and likely to build city cards with energy cards is pushing towards builder. Yeah, yeah, I agree. I think that's why Tass is the strongest corporation in this setup, I think, because it strongly leads towards Gardener, Mayor, and Builder. Means you can attack three milestones. Boom. Yeah, yeah. Although it just, yeah, that's true. And, and it, it has turned out to be that way online. Tharsis seems really good. Um, in, in my play group, Tharsis almost never wins. It always just seems to come up a little bit short. Uh, I feel like. You play with extensions? Uh, we don't. No, not usually. We play on different okay. different boards, but uh, not. We don't use the other okay. ones. So. Uh, okay. The other boards with other milestones make t uh, tasks bad. Okay, we have a lot of great cards here. I know. Uh, it's a tough one. Um, I, I would I would go for Arctic Elch. I, I think, think so too. I mean, with the way that these guys are playing, there's. I mean, they're not playing to the board. Like we could might be a gardener too. Yep. Plus we have. Um, the, t the comet will give us six plants yeah. if you want to. Yeah, that seems good. It's, yeah. I mean, it's okay for me to give Helion a letter because, oh, do we have, how many science texts do we have? We have one. And we have one in hand with uh, Medical Lab. Oh, whoa, this is, this is a tough spot. Phobos Space Heaven is great. Because we have alloys, which means this is four cash production, three points, and a city tile. Wow. I know. <laughs> Plantation is great because we have a second science tech. It will push us even more towards Gardener. And fuel generators is a building tech for free. <laughs> I know. It's, it's, it's a tough one. My, my inclination would be to lean towards Phobos, but I, I, uh, I'm going to defer to you on this pick. The thing is, can we get Gardener without Plantation? Yes, we can, I think. Yes, let's pick Phobos. Yeah. Are you sure? Um, I think, yeah. It's also a city tile. Okay, I think we hack this one, yeah. If Helion plays Underground Detonation, then <laughs> he's basically out of the game. <laughs> Do you, when somebody does something like that, Q, do you just laugh maniacally? Do you just go like, <laughs> like that? <laughs> yeah, 
I'm, I'm more like, okay, let, I, had, I only need to focus on the other player <laughs> because this one will spend all his money to increase his heat production and whoa, that's it. Um, it's 19 cash for two heat production. Wow. This is whoa, the worst deal ever in history. <laughs> <laughs> To quote your president. <laughs> oh my gosh, let's not talk about. Uh, <laughs> let's not talk about that. He's not my. Well, I mean, he is officially. He is your. He yeah. is officially my president. Okay, so. Um, okay, so Helion didn't fall for the letter. That's a sad story. <laughs> sad story. <laughs> I think we just okay. take these two, huh? Yep. Okay. Yep. Okay, we can even play both this turn. Yeah. Uh, so let's, can we? Let's take a look. So I, I agree with you. We are not in any hurry yeah, to get... You can uh, play both. We're not in any hurry to get Builder. So, yeah, so this is 27 total. I also would play both in the first round because there's still Sabotage out there and getting our um, Titanium Stone would mean we lose 12 cash. So yeah. if I had sabotage, I would sabotage us now. Yeah, yeah, and also like obviously we want to get that algae down before the oceans come down. Yep. Okay. Yeah, I agree. We'll play that <laughs> with in the first round. We are leaning towards so many uh, <laughs> milestones. I know this is usually this is... this is usually what you criticize me for. Q is trying to do everything. <laughs> <laughs> no, um, uh, <laughs> we are not keeping too many cards. If you would have like 13 cards to keep any posi uh, any possibility open, then I would criticize this because we are delaying anything to be to have any option. But this way we depend on the on the next drafts. But anything the next draft will give us is good for us. So hey, that's great. Yeah, yeah. Um, all right, so let's go ahead and get uh, Phobos down. Yep. I love when you're playing a space strat. I love getting Phobos Space Haven because it just sets you up for Mayor too. You can just kind of back end yep. into it. And the thing about uh, why we should consider standard budgeting a city is that we will get plans soon. Hey, hey, uh, I don't know who that is. There, your name isn't showing up. I'm, I'm ah. just, I'll call you. We'll call you Ghost. Huh? <laughs> if you if you look on the chat, people are uh, um, yeah. I can, he's called Prevail. Oh, Prevail! I can't see it. He, okay. Yeah, he set his um, name color to the same color of your of the background of terraforming guys. Got you. So, uh, terraforming, not terraforming sorry. master guys. <laughs> <laughs> um, all right, let's take a look here. So he's got six cash and one, uh, one steel. Hmm. I wouldn't go for um, peroxid power. Yeah, I don't see a need to either. Ha! Plants! <laughs> <laughs> You're so happy about those plants. Yeah, because uh, when we, if we play... Uh, the, um, yeah, we'll have enough to make one. Comet. Huh? Yep. And we can put this one on Peronius Mons, which would give us a titanium, which is worth four cash, four cash for us. So you like so, uh, standard project a city over here? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. We should uh, uh, consider this. On the other side, if we set up project the city, we will put us to uh, five plants. Ah, to change the colors. Oh, there you go. Prevail. Um, so, so five uh, plants makes us a target for asteroids. It does. It does. But we do get to lead off next turn. Yeah, this is bad. This is bad. It should be last one next turn. All right. Then because we need three actions to get uh, our thing set up. We need to send a box to the city. We need to play the comet, and then we need to play a greenery. Yeah, we which means you're short. We're gonna get uh, would... we're gonna get Cupola City right now. Um, I think that's what's <laughs> coming. We even might consider to delay the comet one turn, just to have a better position and to have enough cash to do it all. Let's see what the draft shows. So, um, cool. For, for those of you who are on the, uh, the, who came late to the stream, we have special guest Q today. Oh. 
for a for a master class in terraforming. <laughs> you know, Prevail, uh, they've been talking about it, but I know there's been no action on it to date. Yeah, and also the um, the uh, corporation that introduced the online platform of terraforming Mars went bankrupt. So I wouldn't be too optimistic on fast updates. Whoa. Some good cards here too. So we're gonna have two tags, two science tags. Um, what are these guys at in terms of energy production? Uh, let's not forget that we have peroxide power, which means we can put ourselves to, for, to free energy. On the other side, we are already at generation five, so it's a late ironworks. Yeah. I don't know. I'm the, like all of these cards are. I, I probably lean towards trees personally, but um, I don't know what your thoughts are. I don't think that the heat uh, will rise too fast because helium will bump the heat once per generation, but not more gonna be happening. Bah. I think I wouldn't pick up colony ship. I don't. I would. I would either go for ironworks or trees, but I think it's a tough call. I would probably favor ironworks and hope to pick up another energy production. But I'm really not sure about it. Okay, no, I like that. I'm 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 totally fine it's... with that. Um, huh. well, there's our energy <laughs> production. Although building and... industry is pretty good too, huh? Yep. I think it's got to be this. It's builder and yeah, it, it works yeah, our and we have alloys, yeah. Although the giant space mirror is really tempting, we would need to keep both. This is just so much cheaper, though. Yeah, yeah, I agree. Yeah. Uh, sad story. That's okay. We just we, we can just not buy the steelworks and. Um, uh, I mean, the yeah, way... maybe. Yeah, go ahead. If you get another energy card. Now energy card. Hackers. Huh. Uh, do you think you just take uh, regular theaters? No. I mean, I'm not gonna I would, buy it. Would you ha just take this? I would probably hack hackers. <laughs> okay. All right. Gotcha. Because I don't like others to play it against us. Uh, Prevail. I play the board game a, a fair amount. Um, I have a group that I play with. We probably play once a month. You know, uh, on the board. <laughs> there are your trees. Yeah, they came around. So, so let's see here. So we take. I think we can keep trees because we don't have many late game cards so far. I think trees is going to be good. I think I think it'll be okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So I think we start with um, building industry and uh, and skip to use our energy. So it's not hacked anymore? Yeah, I agree. Okay. We should pick up capital next turn. Capital would be the card we need right now. Um, you love So explain why you love that card. You mentioned that. Um, we have peroxide power at the moment. So we have the two energy we need for capital. It gives, we can place it top right which will be free VP worth because we have another ocean we can place there. And it gives us five cash production. Also, I love the tile, the, the color, the white tile in the, in the board game. It's so beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's my favorite. Okay, so Helion is, whoa. I can't agree with that, part, with that player, to be honest. See, I told you, Q. I'm, see, my instincts are more in line with the mediocre player, and so I knew Trees was going to be good. Huh? <laughs> what I'm saying is, like, I knew he was going to bump the... <laughs> um, you, you mean he, uh, he will uh, give us Trees anyway, so yes. we can keep... <laughs> like, I, I understand yeah. the mentality of the mediocre player very well, Q. So... <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. So, are you still thinking uh, standard projecting a city down here, or do you want to just kind of save cash and wait till next turn? Yeah, that's. Uh... I don't want to play these cards because I want to use our steel for them. So, I, mean, I guess we could play towing a comet, but you're right. It, it... We will have. We don't have a unprotected. We don't have a tile on the board. 
This, which means we could uh, I mean, we could also do another play. We could uh, play the comet. We could play a, a greenery tile, and we can put it on the two uh, steel tile. Uh, Just like steel? out here. Yes, exactly there. Which means we get a cashback of eight. That's also great. We I, get I don't, two I steel. Don't hate that. I mean, I kind of like the idea of getting the comet down. Um, do we have st another steel card where we can use? Yeah, definitely. We actually get we so, get a lot. We, so we get three, four, five, six, seven, yeah, eight. Now we'd have to play. We'd have to play this one out here. Mm hmm. Uh, oh, oh. Ah. Yeah. Uh -huh. Oh. Okay. Rip yeah. plants. Well, they're gonna make the trees good, but that's unfortunate. I'm sure they took our plants. Yeah. So I guess there's no there's no reason now to. Um, we could also put the city on uh, on the Pavonius Mons, Pavonius Mons here. Just like slide around here. You. But it, uh, it, it, it makes us vulnerable against. Nah, better, better the two. Uh, between Asia and Noctis is better. And I think I would stand up project it now because it's unlikely that our two plants will get bombed again. Well, what, you never know. But... What do you do? You prefer you prefer this spot to this spot? Yep. Okay. Yeah, definitely. So I'm gonna go ahead and standard project the city. I'm gonna put Ew. right here. Ew. Why why do you prefer this spot to this spot? Uh, okay, let me. I don't really like how um, on the, the the spot on the right, the spots that are. Uh, yeah, I mean, I mean, I get your point. I, I think I just don't like the ocean on the right blocking us and uh, the spot on the top not having any plants. Up here? Yeah. Yeah. I always think this is close. I mean, the thing about and this is that if, if you're planning on dropping oceans, you can get a lot of cash back yeah. in here. But... Um... Yeah, on the other side, we uh, we need two plants right now because the comet gives us six plants. If you choose the one plant spot, we are one plant short next turn. Right. No, I, I agree with that. Yeah. So we have to get a two plant spot, and the two plant spots on the right are not that favorable. Okay, he's playing another comet. He dis uh, that was discarded. Uh, that, that was uncertain. Oh, for oh, oh, okay. I think. Yeah. So I think we're just passing now. Yeah. Oh. So I like uh, another nice thing about this is that we're just so we're in such a strong position for mayor right now. Hey, prevail. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, I don't play with the expansions. Uh, I don't. I like the base game the most. Uh, I don't. I like playing yeah. on the on the other boards because I like uh, mixing up the milestones and awards. Uh, but I don't. I don't like the Venus expansion very much. Uh, I think it's good with five players because it makes the game last another generation. And uh, but generally, I like playing this as a three player game. And colonies, yep, I, re I really wanted to like colonies, but uh, I don't know, it just didn't work out. I, I I don't think it really adds much, just more complexity. How much um, earth text do we have? Probably none, I think. Yeah, we've got uh, none. So I think... I still, it's a Trovian we have to I think it. it's still Miranda Resort, right? I mean... You know, yeah. you know, it's, it's still a cash production and two points. And we might come to a point where we can't use our titanium anymore. I think it's bushes, huh? Yep. We like the bushes. <laughs> <laughs> everyone, everyone loves bushes. <laughs> Is that true in Germany, too? No. We think, uh, <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't want to uh, insult anyone, but I think the bushes are, at uh, the two presidents in Germany are <laughs> Consider a bit stupid, yeah. especially the young one. The young one is like so. Okay, he uh, he doesn't look too bad right now, but yeah. Oh man, maybe bit, those bit guys too. are both idiots. I don't. Um, I, I'm not uh, not fans. Um, do we have energy right now? I, no, we do not. Uh, so I think we can pick up. We can hack herbivores and uh, invite him to choose energy tabbing. Yeah. Okay. Now the, the Bush Senior is um, quite popular here in Germany because he made it possible that uh, Western and East Germany unite. He was president in that time, and he. Wow, Lagrange came oh. around. 
Yep. So I think we keep keep three cards here. Yeah. So he's one of the fathers of the um re from the, of the unity of Germany. So we can't be too mad at him. Yeah, yeah. I mean, Bush Senior, he was uh, he was more of a globalist, you know. But uh, the Republican <laughs> Party, uh, again, we don't need to get into a whole bunch of politics. But yeah. the current state of the Republican <laughs> Party is 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 moved a long direction from George Bush Senior, and not in a great <laughs> and not in a great direction. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, it's. I I can't agree with your whole election system. Yeah, but you know it's it's really dumb. From which uh, state are you? You are from California, or no? I'm in uh, New Mexico. Does your mode actually matter or not? Um, no, he's stealing our spot. I know. Wow. That's okay. Um, all right, so. I think we do need to focus on getting the getting the milestones that we want. Yeah. Um, should we should we try the uh, greedy route and try to pick up all three milestones? <laughs> well, he just funded a planner. Oops. Yeah. Oh, so we have to to keep an eye not to lose terraformer to Helion. That's right. That's why I'm. That's why I think we need to kind of focus on getting those milestones done. Okay. Okay. Uh, unfortunately, we're not. Uh, we don't really have the right cards for that. Um, How many building techs are still missing? I think we're at. I think we're missing two. Oh. Okay. So. <laughs> it's a little tricky. I think we we get down the comet now and the first greenery. I agree. That that puts us in the most flexible position, right? Because then. Yep. Um, uh, he doesn't have steel. No, he does not. Okay, whatever. Yeah. Okay, so let's go ahead and get the comet down, and yeah. uh, let's let's see here. And the greenery. Yeah, that should do. So, it. okay. Mm. You want me to just take this guy over here? Yeah, no, it's okay. Yep. And then we'll take the one that uh, gives us two, yep. right? So we still have 27 cash if I include the steel, which means we could get down Peroxid and Metlab. I, I like that because uh, basically it's still, it's still a surplus, right? We're going to get bump at three. It'll be minus one. It'll be a plus two bump. Um, yeah, the only thing I don't like is that we passed um, energy tapping, I know. and now we play an energy card. This was a slight misplay. I think we need... Ah, Private is in the chat. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> yeah. Um, well. I'm thinking if we can, if we somehow can get both a mayor and gardener, but... Uh, Hey, Private, how are you doing? I mean, Helion can't bump the heat more. Helion is pushing towards Terraformer. Yeah, so I think, I think though, he might get us into range to bushes this turn, too. So I, probably worth... Mm, I don't think so. You don't think so? Um, you can slow play if you want. It doesn't change anything. Yeah. So we'll start with peroxide power, and then we'll you know, yep. we'll just take yep. a turn off here, yep. or uh, we'll we'll do an action at a time. Yeah, it would be yep. bad for us if uh, if he if Helion gets uh, the second milestone from us. That would be bad. Mm -hmm. let's, let's hope he's busy with other stuff. I know, Private. I've I've just been out of town a bunch. Um, I've just been traveling uh, for uh, just for various things. But yeah, have you been have you been streaming on your uh, on your site? To be honest, I shouldn't stream right now. I actually should work, but uh, <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's. Uh, uh, Eleven p.m. thirty here in Germany. I have to go to work in. Uh, seven hours, uh, eight hours, I guess, and I, 
I have about two hours of preparation stuff to get done for tomorrow. What are, what's a, but, what do you what do you teach? What math? Um, um, maths and Latin language. Oh yeah, you teach Latin too, huh? Yep, but I have to do. Uh, yeah, that's, that's what I'm talking about. He's taking our energy now. Uh, that's okay. If we are losing, if we are losing really sh close, then it was this slight misplay. I don't. We didn't really need that energy that much. Um, yeah, but he put himself on four energy. I think he's he's uh, planning Steelworks. Yeah. Or or processor or something like that. Or pro I think we saw anything but or processor. So I'm going to yeah. go ahead and get this lab down. Yep. On the other side, if he's getting down the ore processor, uh, it's another terraforming point he's getting. Ugh. Yeah. The good thing is that we are starting player in two generations, and I think in two generations it might be the point where we should pick up the milestones. So we have one turn on him, which which is a good thing. Yeah, let's hope that the draft will give us some cheap building tax or good building tax, both is... Ha, okay. This is such a bad play by him. Do you... <laughs> all right, I you know why I don't like micro mills at all? He picked, we saw it and we didn't take it and he so he bought the card. Yeah, I don't, I don't like that. It's six cash for one heat production and he's he used heat to buy it, which means it will pay off at generation 12. Whoa. <laughs> um, hey, uh, Q, did you see the chat? Munson is uh, ah. getting a PhD. Uh, whoa. Uh, do you need to learn Latin just to have the um, Q, Q, did you uh, see what he Latinum just, degree? Did you or see are you he actually... He, uh, used no, in, but... he used industrial center to bump his steel. Okay, this. I mean, it's not that bad. It will pay off in generation ten, not twelve. So, <laughs> um, do you need uh, Latin just to have the degree, and then you can forget all about it, or is it something you will need uh, more in your studies? I need to. I need to get my second laptop on sc uh, better. Oh wow! It's... Max, we we just got maximally punished for that energy play. Uh huh. Um, yep. That's too bad because under, underground city would have been sweet for us. But I think we still have to pick it up. Yeah. Um. I mean, Mars it's University just, just doesn't really do. It that pushes much. us both towards towards mayor and towards um builder. I know, but like his taking our one energy actually really makes uh, makes a difference there. Um. So we take his plans with asteroid, I for an eye. And he's only got one. Then we'll take his plan. Just to. What do you think Make about it. what do you think about investment loan if we're going to be uh, fighting for all these? Uh... Um, not much because it's basically just for cash. Yeah. We pay six for the card and we get ten and we lose the cash production. We, but asteroid is costing us. Uh, yeah, I've already decided. Okay, I, I only pick up investment. Ah, okay. Perfect. We actually had a we actually had a reason to get up. Um, investment loan because someone built earth office i think that's or that that's what last game i ah, we have Terractor. we have Terractor. yeah so the Terractor guy is getting more benefit out of um, investment loan which would have been a viable hack plus we uh we passed to him so yeah all right uh let's see here so i mean uh, text we could basically because this helps us get builder too. Yeah. This is this, if you pick up all four. This is builder let's make the right here. Yeah. If you pick up all four cards, then we have thirty cash left, thirty nine, which we could still we could still buy both tectonic stress power and uh, can we place the city to get a cash back something? We need we need a cash somewhere. We could play it. I mean, we could just play it over here. Uh, we could play it here. Yeah. 
What do you think? I, I, I would lean towards keeping eight or all cards or keeping anything but Moss. Yeah, I don't think we need Moss. I, I mean, it's too expensive it's, at this point. It's seven cash. I think yeah. these yeah. three are okay. Those three, it's, it's okay, yeah. So we are setting up both milestones and next generation we key. Okay, my dissertation would be on uh, 16th century Tolonian. Whoa. Okay, no, no, it's totally fine. Okay, Manson, you need uh, one thing which I mean is quite important. 16th century theologians write a different style of Latin, which means um, if you learn the classic Latin that is spoken by Caesar, Cicero, etc., and then you are reading those, then you are like, what? At least it's uh, it, it was for me like this. When uh, friends gave me those uh, some texts like this, and I should translate them, I had some problems because it's a special vocabulary and a special way to talk. So um, I think a good point. I mean, do you know any Latin at the moment, or will you learn it from the ground? So I think our play this turn queue, text stress power underground city. Yep. We play, I think we should play um, Underground City up here. We might have enough cash for Asteroid as well. I don't like playing... I just don't like... I don't want to play that city here. It's just not that helpful. And playing here is like a massive yeah. event. It, 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 it like prevents people from playing uh, um, Urbanized Area and... Uh, what's the other one? Um, yeah, the, the idea is... Private test is uh, another good thing. Down here. Uh, yeah, one, one on the, of the right, I think. Like here. Yeah. I wouldn't mind playing it here, but then you are just begging for, uh, you know, uh, what's that commercial zone or something. If you play it here, we get a steal, which is worth three. We get two cash back, and we prevent ourselves from any hate. I don't know. What do you think? The thing is, um, we don't really need a steal because we might get to a point where we use all the steel we have anyway. After playing Underground City, we have five, uh, 15 of steel product. Also, for five steel production, a steel is worth three, which means we have 15 cash in steel every turn. This might be even enough. Let's play Tectonic Power and... Uh, We're playing that no matter what. It's a point, it gets yeah. a building tag, it's, you know, it's good. So I think we just play that and see what happens. Okay, we can also um, put it on your favorite spot on the right, just to block both. Um, uh, yeah, just to get a grip on both heavy plant places. That's true. Uh, that's not bad, and uh, the plants are not filling up very quickly here. So yeah. um, there, uh, there may be room for us to sort of uh, take advantage yeah. of all that. You're right. We don't really have any other building tags to take advantage of the huge of the of the building production. I mean, yeah. we we could wait and play Underground City next turn. Oh, he really hates us, does he? That's okay. It just doesn't really matter that much. We don't we don't need it. Ah, I forgot to. Okay. Hmm. So we could we could just wait to play Underground City until next turn. No, you lose uh, six cash if you wait. We definitely have to play it this, play this turn. Yeah, the difference though is that we, we don't have a way to spend this steel next turn. Yeah, but we want to claim both milestones next turn as well. I mean, an idea we could play Lacroche to see the card we pick up. Nah, 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 not really. I think Asteroid is a better thing. All right, so you want to go, you want to go see? Yeah, I, I want to get it down. Maybe maybe we pick up something for our steel. I wouldn't, and even if we don't, uh, maybe we want to fund uh, uh, miner so the two steel might be better. Interesting. Yeah, I mean, I think that's. I think it's probably. I think. I think. I, I agree with that probably. Okay. I 
I do like the idea of getting that city down and just kind of blocking that spot. Okay. Yeah. Um, I, I personally can't even decide if, if I was playing on my own. I probably would consider either Tarsus Torus or the spot on the bottom. Down here. Or Yeah. Or the spot we just took. Yeah. Um, <laughs> no, I don't know. I was actually a classics major in college. But uh, I, it's been a long time since I was studying Latin. I, I was I was really into Roman history. I I, uh, I really enjoyed that. Collins Prime of Ecclesiastic Latin. Okay, I I, I think I need to Google, I need to Google this uh, because I don't. One more north? Nah. That's off the off the mark. I think. I think that this spot has value too. Um, but I don't know. I think, I think you raise a good yeah. point, Q, which is that like we just don't we don't have a lot to spend on steel right now. So yeah. It, yeah. it's it's quite possible that this just ends up getting stranded. Um, Next turn will be quite unsatisfying because we will claim the milestones and realize that we spent a lot of money just for the milestones but well we have to do it because we don't want to lose the milestones i agree so should we go ahead and play the asteroid too we have enough i we could just wait uh and wait till we can hit more plants how many plants does helion has helion has one tractor zero so I, th I say we just wait the, the point for waiting is that right now we have to spend six cash for it and next generation we um, can use more titanium for it. Yeah, let's just wait. Plus maybe if you pick up something like Demos or uh, another happy asteroid, we have a grip on the ocean tile with asteroid as well. Yeah, I think we wait. Yep. Okay, I'm just going to pass here. Yep. Yeah, it's going to, I think... Uh, we have no we have no earth text at all. No, and I, getting getting the two milestones here just puts us in such a good yeah. spot. I like I yeah. think that basically we are uh, we have a good lead at the moment. Yeah, I, think. I think so. I think so too. I can't even decide who's the runner up at the moment because Terraptor, um, okay, he has eight VP. He has a milestone. This is great, but he totally uh, forgot to get a heat produ uh, cash production running. Yes, he has titanium production, but um, I mean, if he wants to claim milestones or awards or plant cards, he's so fast bankrupt. Yeah, this trees, trees and bushes are going to be good for us too. With all these, yep. uh, I mean, we're going to have a pretty good plant production. Yeah. We'll, we'll probably pick up another three or four plants here is my guess. We so right now we, have, we might even be able to yeah. fund landlord, honestly. Yeah, yeah, sure. Landlord is great. Banker is great. Uh, can you show all the awards for me? Yeah, scientist, uh, we're behind, but we have a couple science uh, we, cards. Yeah, yeah, yeah. runner up. Banker, landlord, yeah. terminalist. Terminalist. I mean, minor, we're minor. in a good spot. So terminalist is basically the only um, milestone we are looking not that good at the moment. I agree. It's too uh, early for Baker. Milestone. I think, depending yeah, on what happens on the next generation, I wouldn't be opposed to getting a landlord. I think I think we're going to be think, in a good yeah. spot for that. I honestly only like to fund the first award. I prefer to be the runner-up on the other awards without paying anything for it. Uh, we're still going to have some money even after we fund those milestones. Yeah, yeah, just not as much as I would like to have. <laughs> <laughs> that's, the, that's the problem with money, Q. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I guess. Um, ooh, ooh, ooh. Wow. Um, all these are pretty... God, it's, I, yeah. I think it's a little too late for arrow breaking, but... No, no, I don't think so. How many, um, how many uh, Earth Techs does Director has? We are um, passing down two, two, and Helion three. Can we give him Carter? I don't 
don't even think it matters that much. Like, we're, a game's almost over. I mean, it might be better just to take rover construction because we can spend steel on it. It's free. Yeah, but isn't rover construction most likely to come back to us? That's a good point. Um, I mean... Nobody's going to take arrow breaking. I'm not sure about that. I think somebody will take wind power. I think arrow breaking is still a good card. If you pick up another um, uh, one more space event, then it's already paid off. I'm gonna let you make this pick, you. Ah! My 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 inclination would be to take rover just because it's a free point. But I I also respect. I do like arrow breaking. I I think that at this point in the game, this is going to be incremental. Um, I'm I'm considering hacking Carter, but I I think that's reasonable too. It's generation eight. He gets four cash production for eleven money. He didn't play Earth of his city. No, not yet. No. Well, I mean, it's it's like a break even card for them. Yeah, let's. I think let's pick the, the rover then. And we probably keep the card that comes back to us. Um, oh, nice. I like uh, Food Factory is good for us, too. Do we have plant production? No, but we will. Uh, we will, we will, okay. Uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I think that's... Yeah, yeah. I mean, I mean we... anything that we can use that lets us use our steel is so good, right? It's yeah. just free. Yeah, that's yeah, true. Yeah, I was thinking about a microorganism uh, as well because uh, we still can play it. But the other side, it's 16 cash and we pay free for the card, which means it's 19 cash for two plant production. It's not worth it because we have two plant production cards that give us a better yeah. payoff. Also, we're still going to get a bunch of plants when people play Oceans. We still have a whole another eight plants yeah. coming yeah. our way. Yeah, I think the landlord is a reasonable award we should fund maybe this generation so maybe let's go let's go milestone milestone landlord oh wow Whoa. what hello all right well i think we just those take cuts are how many tokens do we have we've got two but we've got two Ganymede and too. two in the hand in the hand which means io gives us five repeats that's five yeah yeah, I think we fall for the trap and keep it. I think we just keep it, and then if it if it looks good, we'll play it. If it doesn't, then we won't. But I, I think we're going to yeah. have time to play that card. Yeah. Maybe even this generation? Yep, this generation. Nah, no, 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 no. We have to pay the card. We are short. Um, okay, so I think we take Rover. Mm -hmm. I think we take Food Factory. Mm-hmm. And I think we take IO. Let's not ah the the arrow breaking. Yeah. I mean it's it's costing us ten money. It gives us free cash and free heat. The thing is arrow breaking is a good uh, card to uh, if we have the thermalist. Because we can get free heat in the last generation. We have 57 cash, we pay two milestones, we have 41, we play. We can't play IO Mining anyways, this generation. No, we cannot. You want to get this one? I think, yeah. You take them all, huh? Yeah. Okay. All right, might, so we're might, gonna, be a, might be a mistake, but... We're gonna, uh, we'll start by taking these milestones. Yep. I just want to have the option for Terminalist also. I mean, we want to pick up uh, space events. Space events are great for us because they have a lot of titanium and you want to p um, get heat steps from Helion. So if you pick anything like Demos, like any asteroid next generation, this is like, wow, thank God we've, we've kept uh, um, arrow breaking. So what can we still play this generation? Well, why don't we, why don't we play out rover construction? Uh, yep, definitely. And then, and then maybe just bide our time and see what happens with uh, yeah. if somebody bumps up the heat, we could, we might be able to get bushes and food factory. And food factory, exactly. I mean, I well, think, and then, and then if if nobody uh, does anything, it might be worth funding landlord. 
Oh, well, oh. okay. <laughs> yeah, maybe we should have um, we should have funded um, uh, one award and uh, one milestone and landlord. We shouldn't have gotten both milestones. Yeah, there's no card that bumps him five except for Terraforming Ganymede. Uh, and, we, yeah. and we have it. And he doesn't have any Jovians. Uh, so, he yeah, can get... Right. He can get four with Ice Asteroid, but even then he's one short. How is uh, how was how was Builder going before we picked it up? Did someone have seven building techs? I guess not. No, I think it was a mistake. I think we should have. Uh, yeah, yeah. Know, we were we were we should have uh, funded that award. You're right. I just got I got so excited about getting those milestones. Kate. Yeah, yeah. Well, it doesn't matter. Um, so at least it was not that bad to pick up um, uh, the. The free heat space event card, aerodynamical thing, I think it's called. Optimal, uh, optimal aeroprint. Aero yeah. Okay, so what we're we gonna do with our turn? Well, let's play. Let's play rover construction. Yeah, but we need to decide if we overpay it or not. Yeah, I think we probably do. I honestly. Yeah, but if uh, we can get food factory down, this generation. If someone gets another heat bump and we play the asteroid, let's see. What and they then, do. yeah, because I I do like it. Like if we can do Bush's food factory, I think we should definitely do that. Yeah, and we can get the asteroid to get one heat step, so we need just one more heat step. Ah, if we get the asteroid, we should also get the aerodynamical braking. Ooh, it's gonna be hard. Let's see here. So we've got thirteen okay. cash. We can play asteroid almost completely out of um, titanium. Yeah. So. Let's say we, we play asteroid. Or, I'm sorry, uh, arrow breaking for seven. Yeah, we, we can still play it all. Yeah, I think we can. Still uh, play. But it might delay uh, IO mining next generation, which I don't like. We need to. Well, I, I think IO. We may or may not end up even playing that. I mean. We will. We will. Yeah. IO is eleven cash production, and five victory points. Well, when you say it like that, I mean. <laughs> <laughs> we have to good. play it next generation. I, I would even uh, maybe. Whew. No, we didn't play our robo constructions yet. No, My, it's so firing back that we we should have gotten robo constructions and. Um, Landlord and not a milestones. Mm. All right. Well, that makes our uh, our asteroids better. Yeah, Terrector is the enemy. I think. You see. All right. So we play arrow breaking and uh, and uh, pass uh, and skip. Yeah, I think so. Okay. No, 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 no. Yeah. Yeah. On the other side, he, has he any way to get his greenery down this generation? Okay, it doesn't. No, unless, unless, I mean, he could have a card that lets him get something, but he's down to very little cash, so. Yeah. Yeah, we should have uh, gotten the award and the, the rover construction. Mm. Too excited. <laughs> yeah, I think so. Um, I mean, I don't. Yeah, yeah. We probably we should have just taken taken our turn on those. Yeah, he's getting a lot of terraforming points. So but Helion one... has negative AP still. I think. Yeah. He? No, he's he's pretty low. He has so, no miles. No. Ah, he got a planner. Yeah, he got planner. So I think Helion is our competition. Yeah. For sure. How many plants Helion has? One. Mm. So we're one away from getting that bump. So I guess next we're going to do Asteroid. And Bushes and uh, Rover and Food Factory. Yeah. Okay. 
We can consider delaying the robots one generation to overpaid with steel. Yeah, I think I think right now uh, let's let's start with uh, asteroid. Yeah. And hit a poor character that is already laying on the ground. <laughs> <laughs> yep. All right, and then uh, let's go ahead and play. Should we just go no. ahead? No. Skip. Okay. I want to play uh, Bushes and Food Factory in one generation in case they are crazy on eating our plants. I don't think so, but no, just... I guess, Birds is the only one that takes two, right? So yeah. they'd have to have two cards. We might, we might even not have needed to play Asteroid because Helion can bump the heat again. Maybe we should have kept, but on the other side, it's six cash for one terraforming point. It's it's good to get down any time. Yeah, we'll be Actually, able to get, we'll get we'll be able to get trees down next turn. That, well, I mean, depending yeah. on what we do with IO. Actually, we don't even have money to get food factory bushes and trover construction. No, we don't. It, we have to choose. So I think it's food factory. Yeah, yeah. Then then it's obvious. Yeah. So we have four plants and one plant production. We should have a look on the uh, on the uh, heat pump for free as well. This one should. Ooh. Oh, he's eating the. Uh, ooh. I don't understand that. Me neither. What's the ants for? And the uh, uh, Teractor guy has the uh, free microbes as one victory oh, point. Oh, yeah, you're right. Okay. Forgot about that. Yes, yeah, still. Don't like Ants Generation 8. No, I so don't. So we we'll play Bushes and Food Factory, our favorite bushes, <laughs> and then. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, Teractor does have protected halves. Yeah, but um, due to the bug, you maybe still can eat his... No, I, uh, I clicked it and it didn't work. I forgot about that. It didn't take his plants. So we chose the rector, but it didn't take his plants? Yeah. Did it take our plants? Were we at five? <laughs> yes. <laughs> That's annoying. So it took our plants instead of his... Oh, that sucks. Yeah, that really does. That really hurts us. Yeah. Uh, so we should have taken Helions. Yeah, that's unfortunate. Um, yeah. Huh. Were were we at five? I can't remember. We had we had five. Yeah. Yeah. Because he played this, this ocean tile. Maybe they reappear if you uh, rejoin the game. Yeah, I, I'll be able to. We'll be able to look later. But oh, that's frustrating, man. Yeah, I mean, uh, if if we uh, if you disconnect and join again, maybe the plants are back. Oh, really? Why? This sometimes this, this things happen. Um. That's too bad. Well, so if we if we lose by if we lo if that makes a difference, then we'll we'll have to, <laughs> we'll have to play the game under protest queue. Yep. We will send an email to whoever is not bankrupt, and maybe that will. <laughs> <laughs> no, not bank. okay. All right. So I think we just pass here because we want to yep. save the option yep. to play IO. It's not an option. It's mandatory. <laughs> um. Okay. 11 cash and 5 VP, just saying. <laughs> and if you pick an Artrobian, it's 6 VP. Maybe the servers are running somewhere and are forgotten, we don't know. That's referring to private. Yeah, yeah. All right. Ooh, Lake Marineris. I like yep. that one. Um, yep, definitely. Yep. Restrict is there a spot for Restrict urbanized? Is good too, but... Yeah. It's a bit late for restricted, I think. Yeah. Okay. You like Marineris? Yeah. Yeah. I think we might get there too before the oceans are down. We'll see. 
spell. One ocean is at zero, yeah, so, so it's gonna be. No one should play oceans right now. Forbidden. <laughs> <laughs> you tell him that, Q. <laughs> yeah. All right. We also want to prioritize uh, building tags. Mm-hmm. Because we just have all this steel. We want to make sure that we get yeah, something to... Yeah. Well, we, we can overpay the robots this generation. I also think this generation we should um, slow roll is to it, see if... Is it stuck on me? Let's see here. Uh, I think the others are still uh, in their draft. We were drafting faster for once. <laughs> Usually, though, when it says you, it's on me. Mm. No, you don't think so? Uh, uh. Oh, no, you're right, you're right. I think it's just to remind you who you are. Huh? I need that a lot, you know. <laughs> um, virus. Yep. That could be good right now. Yep. Aqua for and will... gives us a way to spend... <laughs> yeah, I don't... I think, I think it's virus. This basically yeah. takes a... Oh, no, we can't use it on the guy we want to use it on. Forget no, it. we want to use it on Helion, so we keep it. Helion doesn't, yeah. does he? No, I think it's, you're right, you're right. Okay. Um, mm. Well, probably uh -huh. just... I mean, wave power is a point. Yeah, but it's it's 11 for one point. It's not a good deal. I think, I think header. Okay. And maybe just uh, maybe we we'll, we can just take it. Don't even keep it. Um, All right. So we need to have forty one, but we have a sixteen credit here, so we can take yeah. as much as we want. Um, I think if restricted area is coming back to us, we might pick it up. It's pretty good, like. Over here, but or maybe I mean, the steel may not even be good for us. But we could just play it around his city over here, get some cash. Yeah, and, and two plants, it's okay. Plus lake, of course. Yeah. Okay. I think. What I just, about a virus? I don't think virus. I don't think it's going to be useful. And the header. Uh... I mean, Helion's our competition. He doesn't have anything. Header is nine cash for one plant production, one plant. Probably not. I, I, I think I would keep it alive. Yeah. yeah. Okay. No. So we we get down uh, Roa, then we get down IO. Yeah, so the question is, then do we, do we, we have... want to play restricted area... I don't think we have enough cash for that. So this uh, is 16. Uh, 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 here. We need, if you want to get down restricted, we need a cash back of four by restricted area. Is it four or two? Because this is now, 16 and 35 is... Uh, then it's 10. It's 51. We 10. have 10 cash left, our I.O. But we need 11 for restricted, plus we need 2 for the card, which yeah. means we need 3 cash. Right. Ooh. Huh? Which means we have to get the... <laughs> we probably have to get the restricted down on um, the... Next to Tarector. If we play a restricted, we could play it here. Yeah. I mean, that's still, that's still, uh, it's one less plant, but it's, you know, it's still good. Yeah. The best thing would be if Tarector plays an ocean tile now, then we have eight plants for another greenery. Right. I mean, the advantage of playing this one here is that it gives us eight next turn, but yeah. I don't think it really matters. I think we might be able to get trees going. Too. The thing is, we don't have a trash card. We can uh, sell. We will after restricted. Area. So I think I think we go restricted area right here. Yeah, yeah. Restricted IO and then buy a card. I mean, we could. 
buy the card and then play IO, but is there any card that is better than IO than we, that we might pick up now? I don't even think so. No, IO is still really good because we have a bunch of ways to play these space tags. Like we have, a, yeah. you know, so the space yeah. tags are going to, or the, the, the this titanium is going to be useful. We yeah. don't need to pick up cards for that. Yeah. Hmm. Is there anything we might delay restricted area for? No, not really. I think we should overpay Ooh. for ro Rover as well. We should get that down right now. Uh, ah. Yeah, so we overpay Rover now and wait and skip. What uh, about I that? I kind of like. Oh, wow. Interesting. Um, I like the idea of getting restricted area down here because so yeah. much of our plans uh, depend on that. Okay. What do you think? Yep, yeah, it's. I think we agree. It's just the order, which we are, which is uh, in which order we play our cards. What 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 do you want to do right now? You just want to play rover. <coughs> well. <coughs> I think we should get both ro <coughs> rover, <coughs> rover and restricted because the place for restricted might be taken. I agree. If, so, so let's so, go ahead and play rover and restricted. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to mm -hmm. overpay for rover. Yep. Yeah. And then let's get restricted down. Yep. Yeah. And I'm going to play it here. Yep. Yeah. Exactly. Then we buy a card and we play I.O. and then we are happy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so let's make sure we have enough cash here. So 16 and 28 is 38, uh, 44. Yeah, so we should have, we have enough. Yeah. Yeah, okay. And we still have enough cards to spend our titanium. I mean, we make so many cash with our steel and titanium production and still we somehow can use a lot of it. That's great. Yeah, the steel. Unfortunately, I, I like. We sh I think uh, it'd be great we need to... we need something like what is a heavy steel card? Mohol. Whoa. Capital. capital. Yeah, and there we are again. <laughs> Get a capital. I mean, you are playing. This means that we didn't get capital so far. Is your mistake somehow? Yeah, I know for sure. Why didn't you pick it up? Well. Um... I don't. And you know, if, for some reason, I love that card, but it, I it's hard for me to get it going. I actually don't end up playing it very often. Yeah. Yeah. It's, we let him. Whoa. All those cards we would like to have, but it's such a weak commercial district. I think. Yeah. I mean, this is the advantage of not playing that city here, right? Like, yep. you know, like I, I actually, if you're not planning to really fill them up quickly, I kind of like spreading them apart. Yeah. How is uh, scientist going? Uh, I think we're getting smoked on that one. Uh, not smoked, because uh, we have so, we have one. And if Teractor is not the guy we fear, that means if Teractor is funding scientists, we are still making two points on Helion. Yeah. So actually, all four. No, we didn't see strip mine yet. So we are seeing all four awards in our favor at the moment. Is that true? Let's see. So, landlord, I think we're advantaged. Okay, that's that's good. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's what I mean. Uh, I prefer not to fund uh, the awards on my own, but. Let them fund and be happy. What did we pick up? Birds, nice. That's okay, good. but we still play IO, I think. Man, that's a good card for us. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine it having the generation two or something. <laughs> I know it would have been it would have been gross. Um, no. So next generation. All right. So uh, we need demos now. Can you make it happen? Yeah. <laughs> Give me one second, yeah. and I'll make sure that happens. Focus. Yeah. <laughs> Do the, the <laughs> Sheldon <laughs> Sheldon Cooper focus on demos. I will. I will. I will. I mean, you know, we really deserve we really deserve it because we took our own plants away. Yeah. It's, yeah. it's only so just. We can, yeah. 
True. Yeah, but I think we're in a really good position this game. Yeah, I think so too. Um, we have still Ganymede to play. We have still Marana Resort. And there are so many cards in the draft that would be simply good for us. Usually it's, Plus, it's we have a lot of potential versus, in the board. What, uh, hmm? I'm sorry, Prevail had a question about how much uh, the deck is. Usually it's about 90%, I think. I mean, it depends on how much card drawing is going on, but it's you get through a lot of it. Use the force. I totally agree. Ooh. Uh, he played commercial tour. Yeah. Ah, the Helion guys are doing a lot of terraforming. The thing is, we're not that far behind. With terraforming Ganymede, we're already at a plus four yeah. bump here, so... Yeah. Um, all right. Yeah. I think that's all we got, Q. Hey, we have eight heat next generation, so we have a, a free heat bump, actually. Yes, we do. G good eye. Uh, yeah, because if we can get to minus four, it'd be it'd be great to play trees. And yeah, I mean more for the free ocean. If we get up, if we get demos now, the free ocean is ours. All right, here we go. All right, I use my magic on it. Yeah. Demos. Probably <laughs> someone has it from start just for this. Oh, and if we get Demos, that also means that our seven plans are. I know, I know. We're, we're vulnerable right now for sure. Um, hmm. <laughs> Tropical Resort would be great if we had heat production now. Yeah, I wonder, should we just take. Are we setting anybody up with this magnetic field generator? No. Uh, none of these cards are great. I, I could see... I mean, we should... Uh, hacking permafrost to for Lake Marinos? Yeah. I mean, we are just giving somebody two points. You know, we're giving Helion two points off this tropical resort. Yeah. Maybe we just do tropical resort. Yeah, and maybe get... Maybe hope for some heat production. Yeah. Agreed. What a bad draft. Uh, and it's getting worse. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Really miserable. So just take Earth Office from. I think we're passing uh, down. Yeah, but Earth is for what? I mean, are there any other Earth cards? Yeah. Well, um, let's see here. We have. I mean, we have. Uh, oh, no. We don't have any. Yeah. I mean, we can get one cash production from my rent. Nah. I mean, if we had an Earth card, it pays for itself, but I don't know. Maybe we just take that and see what we get. I, I think it doesn't change yeah, much. It doesn't really change anything. So. Ooh. Now, hold on a sec here. You know, if magnetic field generator comes around, this this would put us close. Yeah, yeah. Um, what do you? The livestock. This is good too. Uh, yeah, but it's thirteen, and it's eating a plant. I probably would go terminal. Let's see, and if we get if uh, if we wheel yeah. uh, magnetic field generator, it might be worth yeah. it. We have something to use our steel for. Yeah, exactly. Wow, what a horrible draft. So many cards that would help us. And... No, mineral deposit. Well, um... Keep the earth office, what do you mean? We could just keep this, it's three. Do you want to take Tropical Resort too? And hope for some heat production? I mean, there's a lot of cards that would do it, but... Yeah, we can, I think. We can also consider keeping earth office. Uh, nah, nah. I think we keep these two and we, we may not play them, but it, it's possible. Yeah, okay. Or, or do you want to just skip them? And we get to draw a card for free. There's that. So. We... 
I mean, there's like I mean, there's GHG Factory. There's there's a whole bunch of things that that could make Tropical Resort good. Yeah, I, I'm just thinking about the Earth Office if it's worth a shot. Because we have Miranda Resort. We're going to draw a card here, too, at LaGrange. So we're going to see yeah. two more cards. Yeah. It's, I think it uh, it can be a good decision. Or not. I think it's what do you think? not possible you, to decide. What do you think about these guys here? Yeah, it's okay. All right, you want to take this one, too, or not? I'm, I don't know. It's, it can be both right and wrong. Let's skip it. Okay. All right, so what are we going to do this turn? We are going to... Buy a card. And... Play a LaGrange. I like the idea of seeing these cards before we commit to anything, but... Um... I think we should definitely slow roll this generation. All because right. there are both the ocean and the heat bump in range I'll and we are I'll starting right player here. next generation Yo. Ouch. Oh man, took our plants. Well, we get four plants from the oceans. This makes Lake Marinerus worthless as yeah. well. Um, that's tough. At least it was Teractor, though, because I think our main competition is the other. And it does it does put the ocean bonus in range for us. Yeah. I think we get um, standard project yeah. heat bump and our free heat bump. Yeah, because there's no other way to bump the heat. So, yeah, just bump a heat and take it. Yep. Okay. So at least Helion is not getting it. Oh. All right, and then uh, we'll take some plants. Yeah, I think I would I would get uh, one, nah, maybe two cash or one plant more. What do you think is better? Yeah, I guess here is good because we're going to play the plants right here anyway. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. So let's hope our plants, our eight plants, don't get bumped again. I know. Um... Because we have trees, if, we have trees coming down too. So if we can start, I mean, this is a yeah. really good spot for us to play something. Yeah. On the other side, if uh, okay, if uh, Helion decides to play an asteroid now, he's paying money to not get heat steps. So, right. Feel free to do so. Oh, uh, ho ho! The free heat bump is coming. Helion has still his. Um, you might consider standard projecting and greenery here. Yeah, it'd be that'd be amazing, huh? Because it also gets us a lot of cash. But I mean, it's just really good play. Yeah. Let's see we, what happens. We play our. We play a greenery. We standard project a greenery, and we get a free heat bump. Yeah, it'd, I think be that's a, the play very here. Very good. And then, I mean, we, we only have uh, Ganymede that we have to play. Yeah, still. I agree. But I still think we're going to have time. I, like, this, this ah. is going to take a generation, and we, we have so much money, we're going to be able to get most of this stuff down. We can't play trees if we go... Ah, okay, let, let's do the maths. If you do the standard portrait greenery... There's your, there's your favorite one, Capital. Yeah. 
Okay. Ouch. Ouch, ouch, ouch. And he's getting bank. He has 20 cash production. How much do we have? Uh, we've got 16. Okay, if we stand up both to the greenery, then we have left three, uh, five cash. We get a refund of six. We have 11. We get another greenery, which means we have 13, which means we can get trees also. That's good. Yeah, I think I think that's just such a strong play. I, I yeah. mean, um, yeah, we can't let him the free heat bump. No, and we get four plants back too. Like, yep. okay, if we get trees down, we get to immediately play another uh, yeah. uh, uh, yeah. greenery tile the next turn. Like, it's just so yep. good. Yep. All I think he he set up for the double. Um, heat bump as a double up oxygen bump as well he plays the city right now so he so he can get a greenery standard project and the um, free oxygen bump he can get next so we have to do it now yeah no i agree now is the time to do it the only thing you might fall short to buy a card from our oh oh come on it's not that bad though like i mean we still get a bump to the to our money. Yeah, but they're throwing a lot of haters at us right now. Well, I, but I think that's appropriate because I think we're winning. All right, here we go. So let's go ahead and get this down. Mm -hmm. And so. I mean, I think I think that's. Uh, Getting those getting those bumps is so good. Yep. I mean, they're they're all like two point plays because. Uh, Do we have two cards we can sell? We have one that we can sell because we can sell like Marineris. Uh, and honestly, this was just a speculation anyway. We can sell these. Yeah, uh, I would consider overpaying ge geothermal power disgeneration. To get a little bit heat, do we have any chance to get second in terminus still? I think, uh, let's see here. How much does he has? He's got a ton. But he's using this for a splitting plant, isn't he? No, it's Helion. Oh, it is. Okay. Wait, Helion doesn't have... Helion spent his energy. Ah, he can... Ah, this generation, he can use it. Hmm. Okay, yeah, you're right, it was Helion. So I think the game ends next turn. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right, so we're, our next play is going to be to get trees down. And um, we can play, we could play Lagrange first. Yeah, but either we pay, uh, if you use two titanium for Lagrange, which you definitely should do, then we pay one money. So even if the card is bad, we have to sell the card for one cash, and we are didn't win anything. Sell Marineris. I mean, it's still two points for eighteen cash. It's not that bad. Yeah. Okay. Um, but you probably won't have time for it. Well, we have so, to. We have to get trees down. Yeah. So, so why, let's just how play about? That. Or we play lacrosse, check the card. Yeah, we have to get trees anyway, so we don't need to get the card right now. Yeah. Ah, <laughs> didn't get it. All right, so let's go ahead and get I, I agree to play trees and uh, wait with lacrosse for the next generation. All right, and then... Yeah, you can't buy a card, but no. And I, I agree with you. I don't want to sell any of these cards. Like I, I wouldn't mind selling. I mean, we could sell both geothermal and lake mariners to buy a card. Yeah, I mean, hmm. Or we just play geothermal this generation. I kind of like just playing it. Yep, I, I agree. Yeah. We we also have uh, the aerodynamical thing, so maybe if we get another space event. Yep. Oh, he has the card I didn't want him to have. Caretaker contract. Yeah. Just because it gives him a bump to his. Uh, I don't. Uh, you, you like that card, huh? 
Uh, in that situation, yeah. How many science texts does uh, Helion has have now? Mm. So if you play our science tech, it will be five four four. Mm. I think I think you should play Geothermal. You shouldn't. We shouldn't give up on uh, on the runner up terminalist. I agree. And maybe we can have a shot at. Yeah, we we need more science ticks. So. We don't have any okay. tags, so yeah, that's I think it. We're, I, I think we're just. I think that's it, huh? He then has five actions to do. Which means it's it's really hard for us to slow roll, which would be next important next generation. Because maybe we are in a situation where we can decide to end the game or not. So we definitely should know if it, if we are leading or not. Uh. How many cards does he even have? Um, he has got eight cards. I think we're going to want to end this game quickly because I think we're winning right now. And I mean, I, I, we don't have a bad engine, you know, so it's not, it's not completely clear that we would, you know, not benefit, but. Doesn't he don't have a uh, Earth catapult as well? Yeah, he does. Uh, yeah, he really has a he has a good engine. Oh wait. Yeah, he has. He, did, here. Yeah. he, he played Quantum Extractor. He has five science techs right now. He does. Yep, he's gonna get that one. Whoa. There's still a chance that we could get it. Like if we got research or something, we could at least make it. Uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and then he's making moves like this, but I'm not. Mm. Yeah, I don't really understand that. Like, um, I mean, the thing is, we closed the gap on the terraforming, which is where we were behind the most. Mm -hmm. um, we have more VP. We have a milestone more than him. It's just the awards that are. And we're winning on board, so. Yeah. Not too shady. Yeah. Oh, do we have enough for ecosystems? We're missing a. We have. Yep. Yeah, we have uh, birds. Perfect. Um, On the other side, carbonite processing unlocks. I would I would take advanced ex ecosystems and hope to and hope to get carbonite processing back. Honestly, any of these cards are good. Yep. So it about ecosystems yeah. is. Oh. We do need to make sure we have enough money. Mm -hmm. But we have a bunch of titanium for terraforming Ganymede, so we should have enough. So we're five, this will be six plants. So if we pick up uh, if we pick up that uh, like any of the plant generating cards, we'll get another plant. Mm -hmm. We should, uh, we should know if the game ends this generation. Yeah. So, hmm. You want to just take comments? Of, I mean, nobody's going to play it, but no. Um, GHG Broken Bacteria is a science check. Okay. Yeah. Which good might call. be super important. Yeah. Good call. Good call on that one. So I think we should even keep it. Yeah, I see what you're saying. We definitely have a lot of cash this turn because a 28 here for Ganymede. 
solar power yeah, support. Yeah, that's great. It's essentially free, so. Mm -hmm. All right, so. Yep. We keep all four, I'd say. Do we have enough money to do everything, though? Yeah. So we're getting rid of this. If we're going to play ecosystems, we have to have birds. We might fall short on birds and ecosystems. But if the game ends this generation, I think it's worth it. Huh? All right, we'll take them all. Yeah. I'd say so. I mean, these we can, pay for, we can pay for these with uh, steel, yeah. so. Yeah. All right, so let's start by playing our uh, plant. We could even play it here. Uh, this gives us three more money back. Like, is is this better than the plant? We've got nine. We'll be at one, and then we're gonna play. So we'll have five plants. How much steel do we need this turn? Uh, I mean, we can. can Thirteen? Can you have uh, thirteen? Thirty? Yeah. That's Thirty. Yeah, we don't really need more. This, this would make it free, because it's we could use all ten of it. On the other side, uh, yeah, I think it's... it's, it's uh, yep, yeah, I think uh, it's better to actually get this deal here. Yeah. Okay. Because I don't see ourselves getting another uh, greenery this turn anyway. I don't think so either, yeah. Yep. So we just skip the next generation, uh, I think, uh? want to definitely play as slow as possible. So I would have even considered not getting the greenery down because this oxy oxygen step we are giving them might be the point so they can finish the game. I Don't you think we want to finish it? I mean, I think we're winning right now. I think it behooves us just to end it. Yeah, but we can't finish it on our own. Right. Yeah, I think I think we want to get down a lot of stuff this generation. We can just start. We can just start doing the kind of slow roll on uh, on uh, just playing these guys out. Yep, we should not forget that. Um, uh, let me think. The Thermal effect, which steals to heat production. We saw that card, and we we didn't take it. So if we slow roll on the heat production, they might it might get taken from us again. All right. Well, do you want to start with? Um, I mean, we could just play Miranda Resort. Mm, nope. We might need the titanium to get Ganymede. I think. We should start with uh, solar, or, or or we could start with buying the card for two cash, because we probably will do this anyway. What could we? What would we draw that would change our plays? Because that two cash might end up being important. Um. Well, it's basically only one cash because we can't sell the patent. That's true. That's true. We might draw a card that we want to use our steel for, except yeah. solar power. Yeah, that's a good point. Yeah, I think you're right. We should probably just draw that. But what else might we draw? Hmm. What about like a uh, strip mine? Hmm. Yeah, but strip line is basically only two points right now. Okay, it's it's pushing us towards the end of. Okay. Demos down. I think it was good to get down our uh, uh, our greenery. Okay. Uh, buy the card. Hmm? Yeah, let's buy the card. It might not end this generation because no one has plans left and we still need 
three greeneries. How much cash do we have? I think we've got 38. So we could stand up project two greeneries, but not three. I think we should start now just going and just playing these uh, these cards. Solar power. Cool. Yeah, like, uh, yeah, solar power. And just like basically just take our time and see what happens. Because yeah. if these guys pass and we do the math and we're winning, we can just end it by buying standard projects. Or I guess yeah, but we can only get two greenery, right. so we rely on one help. They need to help us in some way. I mean, honestly, also, if it goes another generation, I don't think it. I don't think it hurts us. It's just just takes yeah. a long time. Yeah, his his engine is still crazy. The Helion engine. The thing is, we might not be able to get Miranda Resort and only to get Ganymede. Yeah, no, I agree. That's still that's still like what four points, six points. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, it's it's still really good. So uh, seven seven points. We have a multiplier. That's right. Yeah, you're right. Seven points. Seven points for five cash sounds like a good deal. <laughs> yeah, I, <guess>. <laughs> <laughs> I think so. The deal maker. <laughs> Maybe Helion, maybe Teractable. Ter yeah, but he can't grab two plants with one card. If he has farming or so, if if he's getting farming and then a greenery down, then it's, things are getting interesting for us. Yeah. There you go. You yep. called it. You <laughs> called it. Wow! Look at you. Yeah, we saw we saw uh, farming uh, getting passed around and not uh, coming to us back. So it must be somewhere. All right, so let's just go ahead and do... Dota uh, Pearl and uh, skip. Yeah, I agree. Should I overpay for it? Yep. Yeah. We also must not forget that um, we have two science techs in hand. Yes, and so we want to so, see where this... This is why it's good for us to slow so, roll here. So if the game ends and we can pull, ooh, uh huh. Yeah, because we could, we might be able to tie for second at least. Yeah, for first we might tie it all. Yeah. Hmm. My guess is the Helion player. If Helion back. doesn't have any science check in his eleven cards, then. Hmm? <laughs> I think he's got one though. Yeah, he's starting using one action per turn only two. Purple might be might be done this generation already. He has, he has four actions. What are those four actions? Yeah, they're just. Uh... Sell steel, he did. Uh, uh, yeah, he might, he might be done soon, soon. How can you tell if they've activated the action? Yeah, you can't. You have to uh, check back the lock. Oh, okay. So, do we take the risk of getting our heat stolen by the firmer thing, or do we play both in one generation, uh, one in one turn? I think we probably just play them both. Yeah, I agree. It's just not it's not worth it. Those two points may be important. Yeah. Yep. We haven't drawn any space event since you played Aerodynamical. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Welcome to my world, Q. Hmm. That's, that's... I mean, not even the uh, cheap, uh, cheap space events like the draw two cards thing with the um, science tech on it. Yeah. That would be so great. I'm, so, un I'm so unlucky, Q. See, now you know what it's like to play with me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> The only thing we are getting is the hate. It's all right. I think we're still winning. Yeah. Um, um, we could also buy the card if you want to. I think we did it already. 
Oh, we did. Yeah. Oh, okay. This so I'm going to go ahead and play Carbonate. Yep. And I'm going to go ahead and play this one, too. And we got rid of our steel. And we are fighting back in a uh, maybe funded banker. <laughs> Let's see, we're at 20, 20, 12. That was yeah, great. The, we used all of our steel. That was great. Um, our bad move was to fund both the milestones and not Grover and I know, and know that was. That, I got too excited there. And then we bombed our own plants, just to be sure. That was... I know that was that was annoying because that I think in the end that will have cost us a plant. Like looking at what we have right now. Yeah. Um, okay. If we uh, can you show the board. Yeah. Noctis farming. How much cashback can we get if we have to stand a project two greeneries? Uh, not much. Because we, we only Just have two. Six. I mean, two on the first one and we four go, on the second one. We could go one. here, here. If it, if it thinks we really go hard. So we have to pay 46 for two greeners. We get back. We are three short. We have five. <laughs> are we just one money short to play Ganymed? Well, what we could do is we could just start selling cards here, like ones we're not going to play. Yeah, I've, I've already um, included that. If you get a cash, cash back of six, we still are free money short to send a project to greeneries. Yeah. So we have to sell three cards to get this one. But then we have five cards and we have five cash missing for Ganymede. So we can sell four cards for Ganymede. Means that we are one money short and this is the one money we used for our action. So this yeah this one. Okay. Let's see. We might end up not playing Ganymede. I mean the thing is though Q is that like if we go another generation, we're just going to score a ton of points then too. So it's not even like it doesn't even. I mean, even, I'm ready to end this game just because I think we're winning it. But um, it doesn't. I don't think it's bad for us to go another generation. Like, look at all the points we yeah. have in hand. So what about this? We play Lacroche Observatory next turn, and we give up on. Buying two greeneries and Ganymede, which we can't. So, mm -hmm. it is. Mm -hmm. This guy might actually be done soon. I think he's done. So, I, I, at this point, if he, I think we should just keep selling cards, and then once he's done, we can calculate what the points are, and we can just decide if it's time to yeah. end it. Because the thing is, the two greeneries also pick us up uh, additional six points, right? Like it's yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, what about this? We we fund, we buy two greeneries, we buy Lagrange, and we don't get Ganymede. I think that's what it's looking like. It's uh, as only if he if he, if he secure. Oh, he played another science team. No, he just no. That was off of. Uh, that was. Off ah, of, he finally got he his micro. He got his micro. Oh. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna sell. So, I'm gonna sell. Uh, well, we could. Oh, yeah, or we get Lacroix Observatory. And then we just and then Ganymede is just if it goes another generation. Yep, and we keep getting it if it goes in another generation. Mm -hmm. I think we can actually play both of these, right? We have seven times four is twenty-eight, so we can actually play both of these. Yeah. All right. So but, uh, let's do Lagrange. Do we? And do we, I don't think we should overpay. I don't think so either. I think we're. Yep. Okay, so we're gonna go. Yep. Maybe we draw the super duper card now. 
power plant. Yes, that's it. <laughs> well, it's a card that we can sell. Wow. <laughs> All right, so how many points does uh, this guy have? So he's going to be... So Thermalist is 16. Sure, I don't, um, I, I, we need to see his VP now because if he passes, we can't. He has 11, okay. I will get a uh, paper to calculate. <laughs> Man, this is definitely great having Q because I would never calculate this out. All right. Okay. I, I just told everyone, Q, that this is great having a math teacher because, like, I would never do this. <laughs> uh, do you remember the stream when we had, like, when I had, like, three minutes on the clock and I was calculating anything and private was like, you don't have the time for this. <laughs> I'm fine. <laughs> oh, Saturn. Helion and Terraform, 34, 40, 35. is one for Helion and two for us, I think. That's correct. Okay. Then we piece. Uh, Helion has 11, I think. Terraptor 15. Yeah, so Terraptor has 15. Uh, we're at 17. Helion's at 13. I think it's only 11. He played Priped. Yeah, he you're played right. Priped. You're right. It's 11. Um, so I'm just so gonna, he, I'm gonna sell power plant here. Yep, Terraptor was seventeen or fifteen? Seventeen, I think. Uh, fifteen. Fifteen. Okay. We are at seventeen. And we okay. are at uh, seventeen. Yep. Okay, cities. Helion has whoa, no greeneries, no cities. He's got uh, capital, but that's just that's in his yeah, points, right? VP. No cities. No has does Helion has plant production? Can he get another greenery in the conversion phase? No. No, he can't. So Terrector, can Terrector get another greenery? I think so. No. No? No, he's at five. Yeah, I think he's done now. That's that's like everything he's got. So Terrector has two two. We have three four greeneries right now and four city points. Well that's easy to calculate. Awards. Alright. Can so you show the I need to see the awards too. Yeah, so right now scientist is six five four. So, so Terrector wins it and Helion and we are the runner up if we we have another science tech, I think. Yeah, but we won't have yeah. enough money if we buy two greeneries. Ah, that's a good point. Wait, do we actually have enough money to get... Ooh. So we've got... We need 46. We've got 38. Uh, we, have to, we have to sell all cards. That's right. Yeah. But we can do it. Okay, so we... Uh, yeah. And then for, for heat... Uh, we're at we three. Should, well, we, have five. we should have we should have overpaid. Um, we should have overpaid uh, De La Croix. We yeah, need we're, to we're gonna be last on heat. So Helion's gonna get first on heat. Teractor's gonna get second. So they are both getting seven points on awards. I think. Yep. Okay. So right now we are at 44, 48, 52, 69. Helion is at 63, and Terrector is on 50, 61. So right now we have a lead of six points, I think. All right, so let's just go ahead and end the game then. Yo. So I'll go ahead and standard project this greenery first Yo. And before we sell any cards. So should I put it yeah. here? Yeah, probably here. Yeah, yeah. Then we can decide whether or not we have enough money to do this, so... All right, so 17, so we need to So sell. we skip the next turn. Yeah. If he is able to sabotage us or something, then... All right, then we sell all six of these cards and we standard project. Yeah. Yep, we, we, if we had overpaid uh, Lacroix, we would make two more points. Because then we would have one cash, and this one cash is the Miranda Resort we could play. Yeah, yeah, you're right. But, yeah, I didn't see that coming. That's okay. So, 
are we happy with our performance? Yeah, I think we smoked it. I mean, like we would have gotten a whole bunch of points in that next uh, in that next round. Yeah, but on the other side, we lost like um, uh, six to ten points just because of sloppy play. I agree. Uh, I you know um, there is definitely room for for improvement in there. Um, and look, we would have ended up with exactly one more if, if those three plants cost us another plant. Yeah. Uh, Plus, we didn't fund the landlord. We didn't play Ganymede. <laughs> we didn't play Miranda. I know. But I, you yeah. know, the thing is, though, is in that one, we were in complete control the, the whole time, right? Like, I think, That's true. you know, like if we could have done other things and and prioritized getting Ganymede yeah. out, um, we, just, we just didn't need it. So. Yeah. I just hope I didn't make any miscalculations, but I think it. Your, your reputation as a mathematician is on the line. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think it's okay. Okay, so if I'm right, then Helion has 63, Terracta has 61, and we have 75. Uh, all right, here we go. 75, 63, 61. Let's all right, see. let's see here. Oh, those milestones are so, so helpful. Hmm. We're just inching forward. <laughs> yep, Six, 64 right. at Um Okay, I need to see where I made a mistake <laughs> in the in the final result. Yeah, let's see here. Um, so okay. those victory points really helped us. I'm glad. I'm glad we were able to end it there because ah, uh, 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 Helion. Uh, Converted eight heat into a terraforming point. I didn't have that in my. I made the calculations before I did that move. Oh, uh, gotcha. Okay. Um, let's see here what they say here. Um, Manson, I think are, hmm, it depends on the game. Sometimes no points. Uh, sometimes in this game maybe five to ten points. <laughs> I brought I brought Q down to my level in this one, so. Uh, <laughs> It does, you know, Munson. It does. It does make a difference because um, if you're if you're not talking through your plays and you're not interacting with the chat or with another person, you're just completely focused on on things. And yeah. for me, it really allows me to um, remember a lot of small details that I forget uh, if mm. I'm chatting. Um, nah. For me, it's more a problem that I can't go uh, into the the very deep place that need most of my time for example I would with the milestones I wouldn't fund them so early if I wouldn't stream because I can always have a look at the other players and see if I need to fund them right now but if I'm streaming and chatting besides then I can't check this every turn because I'm busy yeah so I better fund them now yeah I, I'm I totally agree um, and because uh, terraforming is a game where small margins make a div big difference uh, you know, uh, those things. Those things really do yeah. make a difference. Uh, for Lightworker, I don't think for me it's 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 not about forgetting. I mean, I, I made several calls like farming on uh, Terraactor. I said, hey, he will play Greenery because he will play farming, and boom, there it went because I remembered that we passed this card and it didn't come back to us. It's more like there are a lot of uh, technical things that require a lot of time and uh, focus. Lightworker, ah, okay. Lightworker is saying that I'm the one that forgets, <laughs> <laughs> and he is absolutely correct. Uh, but it is it is actually really helpful to have the chat catch up on those things, um, and it's it's mm -hmm. fun because then you know like the chat's mm -hmm. part of the win, you know. So um, I, I enjoy that. But uh, Q, it was it was really fun having you on here. That was great. Yeah. So uh, I'd say we'll do this again. Yeah. So you know um, what you can do is. Um, well, here, let me do the sign off real fast for this one. Um, so thanks, everyone, for watching this one. If you're catching this on our YouTube channel, uh, it's your, our first appearance of Q. Uh, hopefully there will be more. And uh, thanks for watching.